How much money can you make with affiliate marketing? This is the question I'm going to be answering in this video. Let's get into it. So how much money can be made with affiliate marketing? Frankly, anything can be made. There is no limit to what can actually be made, okay? And I will share with you some stories about that, all right? But first, we really need to dive into a certain number of things before we actually talk about the full amounts, okay? Because really the limitations are more you than the actual market itself. Think of affiliate marketing as recommendation marketing, meaning you're telling people what it is that they can actually do and get, and as a result, you can actually start making some money. So first and foremost, let me ask you, what's your goal? This is the first thing you really need to have in mind as to what it is you actually want to achieve in affiliate marketing. Because understand that not everyone is the same. Some people want to make multi-millions of dollars. Some people literally want to make tens of millions of dollars. I know I myself, I used to be in that frame of mind, but not so much anymore. For me, I'm more lifestyle driven. You know what I mean? I want to spend time with my partner, with my kids. I want to play basketball every single day. My business drives more my lifestyle than it does about making tens of millions of dollars, okay? I'm not really about the money, I'm more about the lifestyle, time, and choice freedom that I have as a result of running a business online. So what you need to do first and foremost is figure out what it is that you truly want to achieve. And there is nothing wrong with having a lifestyle business. If you're happy and more than content with $100,000, $250,000 a year, $20 million a year, that's fine, okay? At the end of the day, you need to define what really motivates you. You gotta figure it out what it is that you're really doing this for. You gotta find out how much that amount is and then we can start working towards it. So the second thing, what I don't like about this question is that it has a certain expectation. It says, you know, if you're typing in, how much money can you make from affiliate marketing? It's kind of a mindset where you're basically saying that you're expecting to make a certain amount. Now, we'll talk more a little bit later about what your experience and, and knowledge is, but first and foremost is I would check that kind of mindset. I would shift more my mind to how much can I make to how can I actually earn it? How committed am I, right? Am I willing to put in the work? Because understand, even in traditional business, people go, in, go into traditional business with the, wrong, with the wrong mindset. And that's why there is such huge failure rates with gigantic amounts of debts, because at least with the online game, you can get in very, very cheaply, if not for free. Right, It really depends how far you want to grow and how quickly you want to grow. But for people offline, they don't realize that they have to pay for a place to set up shop, they have to pay for all the materials, they have to pay for staff if that's the way they're going, and it costs hundreds of thousands of dollars. And before they realize it, well actually it's going to take 18 to 24 months to break even or get slightly in the hole, uh, back into the black. Um, with affiliate marketing, it's really no different. Now I'm not going to say, I'm not saying it's going to take two years. We'll talk a little bit about that shortly. What I'm saying is to check your expectations as to what it is you think that this game is about, how long it's going to take. Because most people come in with a mindset where like, um, the affiliate marketing is just, you know, I'll post some, a few videos on, on YouTube and people start buying my shit. Or I'll, you know, I'll post a few links in some Facebook groups or I'll start spamming everyone on Instagram and I'll start making some money. It doesn't work that way, okay? And depending on whether you want to do free or pay, which we'll talk about shortly, um, it re that'll really determine like how quickly you climb and how much you can actually make in this game, okay? So... Check your expectations and understand that it's more about committing to the work that's going to get done. How much are you willing to earn? How much are you willing to commit to actually make this happen? So the third thing is what is your experience and knowledge with affiliate marketing? If you're going to ask yourself how much you're going to make, you really have to ask you know, what your actual experience and knowledge is, right? This is this is the same sort of thing that any job would ask you. Now, I'm not saying that, you know, affiliate marketing is like a job. It, it is in the sense that you can make income from it. The difference is, is that this is a exponentially growing business, which means, you know, you can you can easily turn up your, your ad amount to really, you know, 10 or 20 times the amount of profit that you make in, in a single day. Now, I've known a guy that who made 45,000 pure profit in just one week, right? I know a guy who makes over $2 million, which is a about $50,000 a week on average from affiliate marketing, okay? But here's the thing, they've had years of experience and they've got a ton of knowledge from everything that they've chosen to invest in. So once again, it really depends on what your knowledge and experience is and what are you willing to invest to actually earn this money back. 
because it's not going to come for free. It is going to take money. It is going to take time. It is going to take a lot of effort and energy, just like anything worthwhile in, in like a, in business, right? So, and, and it's the same thing with life. So if you want a better body, you have to be willing to eat better. You have to be willing to sleep more. You have to be willing to uh, take in more water. You have to be willing to exercise on a daily basis. You have to be willing to sacrifice the crappy foods for the better foods. You know, so building, building an affiliate marketing business online is absolutely no different. Okay, so the sacrifices that need to be made if you truly want to succeed at this game. Now we're going to be talking about free methods and how it actually works in terms of the amount of money that you can make in this in the affiliate marketing business. So remember, affiliate marketing is all about recommending and in make you making recommendations, people clicking on your link and actually making a purchase. That's how you make your money. Now, there's free methods that you can go about doing this, whether it's Facebook, um, you know, you, you build, you adding friends um, and, and creating some sort of value posts or maybe even messaging them and prospecting them, depending on how you choose to do it, it doesn't really matter. But there's Facebook, there's Instagram, there's LinkedIn. Um, you can do YouTube videos, you can do uh, video, uh, you can do slides instead through PowerPoint and put them through SlideShare, right? Any way you could potentially share a link is a possible free way of doing um, affiliate marketing. Okay, so it, that, that way can work for you. And I know people that have made thousands of dollars online, but in terms of like, you know, being able to consistently make say a thousand dollars a day, right? Which is a lot of money. Then those days of being able to like kind of just hustle people online on social media, it doesn't exist anymore. All right. Once upon a time for probably about six months, everyone was excited with this 1k per day formula where they would go out and they would just prospect person after person after person, understanding that it is a numbers game if that's the way they choose to play it, okay? I hate prospecting, I can't stand it. I would rather not hustle people. I'd rather just put out value out there and when people are ready, they come to me. Also known as like content marketing, attraction marketing, right? Putting value first, like this video for example, is value. You're wondering how much money you can actually make from affiliate marketing. I'm here to answer that question as openly and as transparently as I possibly can. And then by at that point, you know, at some point, either you'll like me and go, okay, this guy's this guy cool, I wanna subscribe or I wanna check out some of his training. Or you'll go, this dude's full of shit. I don't really like, I don't like him. I don't like his hair. <laughs> I don't like his freaking beard. I don't like his, his stupid accent, okay? And then you go and find somebody else and that's cool. But here's the thing, I lead with value, right? And this is my free method. This is my primary free method is delivering value through YouTube. So if there's any one of the of them that I'm gonna recommend, okay, if you don't mind getting on camera and, and sharing a message, YouTube is super powerful, okay? If you prefer to kind of hide behind like pictures or, or messages, that's fine, there's nothing wrong with that either. Then I would suggest you go through Instagram, okay? But be willing to sacrifice, um, the, you need to be willing to invest, okay? Because of free methods, yep, there are, there are free methods being taught on YouTube and everywhere else you can possibly go, somebody's giving some sort of tips. But if you really wanna learn, understand, and, and really understand how Instagram actually works, right? then you really need to invest. I, I've got, I got into four courses when I dived into Instagram that were worth 4,000 US dollars, okay? So it was a, a huge investment, but I was really diving into Instagram to understand the algorithm, to understand whether or not I could truly get involved in that game and whether it was actually worthwhile all the time, money, and investment, okay? So if you wanna go um, like into Instagram, yes, it's a free method in, in terms of like you're being able to build your following, okay? But it's, it's paid in the sense that <clears throat> you've got to be willing to invest to actually learn, okay? So since we're already on that topic, let's segue and talk about paid methods, okay? So we're, we're talking beyond like Facebook ads, Google ads, YouTube ads, you know, whatever the case may be for you, whatever ads you want to call it, okay? Whatever method you choose to invest in, that's cool, okay? So learning, in this case, you need to have a funnel, okay? So you need to invest in click funnels. You need to understand, you need to have the knowledge, so you need to... Um, uh, invest in Russell Brunson's training, all right? And then you need an email autoresponder so that you can do what you do. So you need to invest in that. I personally use ConvertKit. Um, I know a lot of people use Aweber and GetResponse and so forth. And then you need to actually invest in the actual ads themselves. So it's beyond just you know sending ads from one person to another. The biggest mistake you can make is trying to advertise a direct product as affiliate marketing and trying to get people to buy because the margins are so slim, especially like if you're gonna do it free through Amazon, the margins are so so slim where you're like you're looking anywhere between like two and seven percent for a product. You know, you screw up one ad, you know, you're kind of fucked for a week. All right. Whereas <clears throat> high ticket items, which is what I much prefer to do, there is a huge gap, right? Yes, I had to invest in an initial initial amount, but since we're talking about paid methods, you know, this is perfectly fitting here uh, in terms of like a topic. So I, I invested a certain amount to get into a high uh, to a high high ticket affiliate program, and that has allowed me, you know, to make up to two and a half thousand dollars 
in one sale, okay? And then make $50 in recurring commissions and um, uh, passive income. And then on top of that, <clears throat> it allows me uh, to make uh, anywhere from 20 to 70%, uh, 90%, sorry, depending on what product they choose to invest in. Now, I'm not here to tell you that that's what you need to do, all right? I'm just giving you the bigger picture here so that you can really think through, think through and figure out what it is that you actually wanna do, okay? So another paid method is blogging. Blogging is another way, like a lot of people are like, well, blogging is free. Um, not if you get your own website, you need a domain, you need hosting, and you need an email order responder so you can actually capture emails, okay? Um, so everything costs, all right? If you're actually gonna build this thing properly, it is going to cost to run a blog. Now, I'll be, uh, you know, blogging is, you know, is a minimum cost, but then if you think about courses, if you think about running ads from, from YouTube, um, from Google to your blog posts, then yes, it's gonna cost money, all right? It's not a 100% free method like most people have you believe. And if you find a platform that is allowing you to blog for free, I would be very, very careful with the terms and conditions, especially for us affiliate marketers. A lot of those free platforms don't allow us to do exactly what we need and want to do to really make some worthwhile money, okay? So be careful with doing that. It would be much better off buying a domain, investing in some cheap hosting, and making money that way, all right? If you'd like to go through blogging, I can help you set up your blog 100% free, right? Um, all you need to do is purchase purchase your hosting uh, and, and then get in touch with us and I'll have my team build out um, your blog for you 100% free, okay? Your hosting will pay my bill, <laughs> will pay my team's bill, right? But then we'll set up the blog for you because you know some people don't like that technical stuff and neither do I, that's why I have a team doing that sort of shit. So the other question is this, can you actually make a return if you're if you're using paid methods? And once again, I'll talk I'll touch upon what I mentioned earlier on. Is it really depends what you're involved in. If you're running, if you've got your own products where you make 100%, then yeah, you possibly could as long as it's a high end product, or even if it's an entry level product, you know, somewhere between. By entry level, I mean like between seven and probably ninety seven dollars. You know, the if if you can if you can spend fifty dollars and make one you know fifty dollar sale, then you've just gotten a free customer for life a paid, qualified, right, willing to invest in you customer for zero dollars, okay? But you wouldn't, you wouldn't necessarily be doing it to make money from a low-end product. You do it to break even whilst you're building your list and then that's when you really start making your money, okay? Because that entry-level product, that $797, that's entry, okay? That's just you getting them onto your list as qualified paid customers, and then you start email marketing to them to take them up that customer value ladder, where they'll go from, <clears throat> you know, the average the, the average customer might, might only be worth $17 um, to someone who doesn't have multiple products or only has an entry level product, whereas someone who has like a big ticket item, you know, perhaps maybe coaching or maybe even something related to whatever niche it is that they're actually doing. In that particular case, the customer, instead of being worth $47, could be worth $4,700. Now, hopefully you can see the gigantic difference there. So the ability to build your list for free using an entry-level product is a really smart thing, okay? So I didn't mean to segue into email marketing there, but there you go. It's already out there. The video has already been shot. Okay, so now you have that information. So how much can you actually make from affiliate marketing? How much can you expect to make from affiliate marketing. It really depends on the first three things that I mentioned and then your willingness to go into either free or paid methods. Both work, okay, you can make a lot of money with free. It just takes a little bit longer because you need to gain that traction. You need to gain your authority online. Now, with paid, it, it could take just as long because you, if you don't have that knowledge and that experience and, and, and ability to know how to, to do paid ads, how to run paid, ad, paid ads profitably, then it could take just as long as you doing a free method. Now, am I saying one is better than the other? No, you need to figure out what your goal is. You need to realize what assets you already have. You need to realize how long it's going to take. What are you willing to invest and what it is that you're really trying to build? Like I said, I'm trying to build a lifestyle business. Yes, I want to make a million dollars a year, but I only want to work four hours a day. You might, you might be thinking, why would you even want to work four hours a day and make a million dollars? Because I love what I do. I enjoy what I do. I'm passionate about helping people, okay? So the million dollars a year is, is not really about the million dollars. My dream lifestyle really only requires 150 grand, okay? But I 10X that goal up to a million a year instead of 150 a year because I want to make a bigger impact. And I know if I can make a bigger impact, the money will come. And then I have every choice and option in the world, I can do whatever the hell I want, all right? At which point, I know 
that I've reached my real goal, which is making an impact, helping people out, building a successful business online. All right, so look, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and subscribe. If you want to be in this month's $1,200 plus prize pool, then go ahead and comment on this video and I'll put you in the draw. At the end of the month, I will release the video as to who actually won. Um, there are uh, some pretty awesome giveaways. We've got courses, we've got channel evaluations, and even some cash prizes up for grab. All right, so if you enjoy this sort of information, make sure you subscribe, click that notification bell, so that you can get all the videos that are coming out. I'm gonna go deep into affiliate marketing probably for the next three to maybe six months before I look at another topic, all right? So if you enjoy this stuff, make sure you subscribe. There's a lot more coming. Take care, much love, and I'll see you in the next one.